Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Um, welcome back to my channel. If you're watching from Patreon, good morning, gang. Um, but we are going to go ahead and get started on a Soul Transformation Sunday message. Okay, today is episode 38. Okay, um, if you're new here, welcome. If you're returning, thank you for the love and the support. The full message for this message will be on Patreon, which is where it originated from. Okay, um, so I don't want to, you know, I'm just, it, 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 it was birthed on Patreon. It came to YouTube episode 31. Okay, um, in which there is a playlist for the videos um, on YouTube. Okay, um, but if you like this message, if you resonate with this message, the full message, we close the message on Patreon. Okay, but you will have a full message on YouTube if you're watching from YouTube. But anyway, today is August the 6th. It is currently 8.21 a.m. Okay. Um, happy Sunday to everyone. Uh, Soul Transformation Sunday. Um, if you're just tuning in, it is your week ahead message. Okay. So it's, it's a transformation message. It's a collective message meant to be received individually. Um, the oracles basically are focused more so on self. Okay. Um, it's not us just spilling the tea. Like we have plenty of other messages for that. But this is your message to put you in alignment in order for you to be able to receive what's for you. Okay. Um, so take it how it resonates. Take it how it applies. Don't force where you don't fit because that could be somebody else's message. Okay. Every Sunday is different. You may not have do where you you may not show up in the message okay um you will know where you fit in it but it won't be your message if you understand what i'm saying okay um but it's it you'll get used to it you know um so just be stay patient um to any leos watching happy birthday nice season we like it here we like it here leo we like your season and everything you know <laughs> we like it um anyway the only way to book a personal reading with me is the email address in the description box below um also perks to joining patreon uh monthly they get um uh, monthly love slash career readings broken down by zodiac sign okay as well as the full soul transformation sunday message um they actually just got divine mask and divine feminine readings on thursday um, and they're about every two weeks. Just, you know, we go with the flow. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into it um, to see what spirit has for everybody. Um, I, I hope that you all have had a great week. Okay. And I pray that next week is also abundant for you. All right. Let's see. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, Spirit Guides, those from the highest white light who offer me every day. What messages do we have for the collective? Soul Transformation Sunday. What do we have for the week ahead? What does the collective need to know? For the week ahead, Soul Transformation Sunday, episode 38. What do we have? Please and thank you. Thank you. Breathe. OMG. Um, kindness. Okay. So Breathe said the breathe says so just breathe okay it says the calmer you are the more time slows down and the easier it is to get everything done so make sure you're not rushing take a moment to breathe okay kindness says what if being kind to yourself really could change everything. So I feel like you guys could be being, some of you, whoever this is for, you could be being too hard on yourself, okay? Some of you could be being a little too hard on yourself. You you trying to, you just pace yourself so that you could get everything done, okay? Um, prioritize uh, your days, your weeks, whatever it takes, but whatever doesn't get, you know, if something, let's just say you have like five things to do in a day. Somehow, one of the things on your list was to go to the DMV. You, it was going to be, you allotted two hours for it, but you were there for three and a half instead. So it kind of pushed back your schedule. 
everything is going to fall the way it's meant to fall. So if you didn't get those last two things done, it left you only one more thing you could do after the DMV uh, in business hours. And you just didn't get it done. Okay. You didn't get it done. You just prioritize it somewhere else. It's basically they're already out the gate saying it's not the end of the world. You have to breathe. Okay. You got regret here and you have friendship. Um, it says that I know that I cannot change the past. Okay. So some of you could be in a state of regret. Okay. But you can't change the past. You have to, you know, I'm getting everything happens for a reason. Um, you cannot change the past. So there's no need to live in regret. What you can do, do. Okay. Um, friendship. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. Okay. So something has something to do with friends. Okay. Clearly. I understand that a friend in my life, I have, that a friend is in my life for a reason, okay? So, so there's definitely some regret here. Maybe somebody wasn't so nice. Maybe somebody didn't make time for you. Just take it how it resonates, okay? And if they did not, if you are the person who, you know, somebody, you know, they weren't interested or they didn't deem you important as a friend, you were put in the back burner of their life, of their schedule, because somehow you know you got to look at it both ways too maybe life for them maybe they didn't take a second to breathe and 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 you know they didn't realize like i haven't talked to my friend i haven't checked on my friend in a while you know like you know maybe it wasn't that important to them um but don't you have any regrets about it it's not for you okay that's that's somebody else's problem people make time for what they want to make time for Okay, so just you have to put it like that. And some people really don't have the time. Okay, so who knows? Who's to say that you're you're want you weren't the busy one, and somebody felt left out here? Just take it how it resonates. Communicate clearly. So it looks like there's a conversation here that could be coming up in this next week, or within the next few months. Okay, something could be significant about something that may have happened a few months ago. Yeah, something could have had something to do with some kind of miscommunication or something that did or did not happen. OK, this would be like plans falling through. It could be anything. It's just something did not happen and somebody didn't communicate with you, you know, what was going on or whatever the case. OK, or they just didn't want to communicate with you at all. I'm seeing the four cups in my head. OK. Yeah, I've been seeing the four cups in my head since we got the regret card, okay? I just feel like something was a had the possibility to be a great friendship, or it was, okay? It was a great friendship. It could have been, or it had the possibility to be, you know, but it was a loss. You got sacral chakra here, the number six. Today is the six, okay? And uh, autumn 21, okay? Um, so definitely something could definitely have something to do. Something may play out, play out in the fall. Um, the number 12 could be significant as well as the number three. Yeah. Something could be significant about something in June. Something could have happened in June. Yeah. Um... So the number three, the number 21, the number six. Okay, let's just go ahead with it. What's up? With, why do we get these uh, oracles? I'm feeling something being, um, I feel like some of you may be creating something though, on another note. Or this is where something has something to do with people who create things. 
you know maybe you're creative i feel like i'm, I'm kind of feeling like a little touch of jealousy N nothing too long and drawn out or deep or anything like that i just feel like it's i feel like somewhere in here is kind of like just a little touch of I don't know just a little touch of uh competition or something like that i for some that's just what i'm picking up um i feel like you know maybe someone doesn't have so much of a like i feel like it's more of a not like a not like a like i said not from like a hateful standpoint i don't know if it got that far for some of you but i feel like something started with just you know like an inspiration turning into not I wish that was me but somewhere they would have swapped like jobs or or creative flair with you or whatever that is I mean I feel like somebody here um because, you know, your sacral chakra is like where all your creative juices flow from, you know. And I just, I feel like it's something in regards to that. Like, so this could be what you, what it is that you do create. That could be, that could have been somewhat of a problem here. I, I'm not sure what, but it's, it's something like someone feeling kind of entitled or I don't know I just I, I feel like I feel like something you created could have helped you you know how some people would be better of a friend to you when they feel like you need them like it's giving me a sense of like this is giving me a sense of someone who they were a better friend to you when they felt like you needed them Although you didn't need them for anything besides what you needed them for in the day that y'all stopped communicating for was to be a friend for some people. I feel like somebody is like realizing where they fell off. Fall. They fell off it as a friend because somebody stopped. When you created a new lane for yourself, for, for, for some of you, where you begin to rise like it's it's something here where this person felt like you know like oh they don't need me anymore or this that, and the third which like i don't know how somehow what somebody does or what somebody creates played a part a role in their friendship mm -hmm. yeah it played a role in how their friend reacted it played a role in it's something like that. Something changed here. Okay. But anyway, something definitely has something to do with the number three for sure. You got the king of cups with the two of wands. All right. What's going on the week ahead? You got the king of wands with the queen of cups. Okay. Already a lot of people in the. Okay. So friend group. Okay. <laughs> you got the King of Swords, the Six of Cups. All right. You got the Four of Pentacles. You got the Hermit, the Magician. Did I say Four of Pentacles or Four of Cups? I meant Four of Pentacles. I don't know. Who knows? You got the High Priestess, Four of Wands. Ace of Swords. Okay. Page of Cups. So something, I'm definitely getting loner energy here. Someone who likes to be alone or you're always alone or something like that. You got the tower, ace of cups. Wow. Mm 
Mm. Ten of Swords. Queen of Swords. So somebody may have betrayed somebody here. Confirmation. Seven of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. Somebody was two-faced here. Ace of Wands. Page of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, Queen of Swords, Two of Swords. Like So somebody said something here. Something also has something to do with some kind of uh, project or a child. Take it how it resonates. I feel like somebody wanted something that was yours for some people. But anywho, in the week ahead, there's going to be some clarity here on investments. Something deals with investments. Um, this could be something that's, you know, old, very old. Something has something to do with something that's old. Now, somebody here could, uh, have an old soul. I'm definitely seeing that. I feel like, I feel what, like an old way of doing something or an old, something that's old is dead. Next week. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. I feel like whatever this is that's dying or phasing out, this could be a friendship that's phasing out. Someone here is two-faced or it's something that's not being said. Now, this friendship thing could be any sort of relationship. It's somebody that you have some kind of back and forth with. Like, this could be brothers, sisters, friends. I don't care if it's your neighbors. It's just someone that you have some kind of a cordial exchange with. Um, I just feel like somebody is seeing the truth. About either somebody playing on both sides. There's definitely a betrayal here. There's definitely some kind of. Um, clarity. I feel like this is details. So. What I mean by details. And I mean shocking details. Something is going to be. This is something that's being disclosed. And it's a lot of it. Whatever this is, it's a lot of it that's being disclosed. And it's it's really a healthy amount. I feel like whoever is where, whoever is where in in wherever, like I'm getting, I'm really getting some kind of like. I feel like something has been some sort of investigation or something like that of the sort. Okay, I do feel that way. Um, you know, on what's what, who's where, and all of that. There's somebody behind the scenes though, so that could be what this is. Somebody could be somebody could have revealed a lot. Like the somebody definitely was wearing a mask. There definitely is a betrayal here. There definitely is someone who is like I don't you could call it whistleblowing, you can call it what you want. But behind the scenes somewhere, two of swords, queen of swords, ten of wands, was someone presenting what was needed. I don't know if you can see that. This pentacle is coming from this person right here that has no face, no name, no nothing in order to provide whatever this is to, you know, um, 
what what the details of something that's needed. That's the High Priestess, that's the Ace of Swords, and that's the Seven of Pentacles. So yeah, it looks like there's some kind of, either this operation is blowing, <laughs> or someone is blowing. Somebody definitely is communicating clearly. Um, and something could have been going on within the last few months, where somebody has just been playing a role, playing a part, um, just to try to try to uh, obtain some some kind of information or clarity on what's what. But I feel like the clarity, something's blowing though. The tower. And I mean, it's drastic. Whatever it is, it's drastic. Something also has something to do with something that was changed, something that could have been changed, like so, something could be like a drastic change. Like it's a drastic, is dr whatever this is is drastic that someone didn't tell somebody about. Something that definitely deals with some kind of identification or how someone identifies or something like that. It's something is drastic. It's mind blowing. Um, but this is history. This is like a long history of like something's being revealed. Something's coming out of someone's past. Yeah, six of cups. Something's coming out of somebody's past. This is a skeleton coming out of somebody's closet here. I don't know what they did. I don't know. It looks like there could be some kind of regret next week. But I feel like whoever this is, though, is someone that you were actually acquainted with in some kind of way. Um, friends or something of the sort. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like somewhere here, I mean, first thing out was people. At least three people. And at least one of these people is playing on the other side. So something could be a third party situation. But at least one of these people, like I said, it could be as simple as your friend having another friend who they tell your business to. Real something small. It don't matter. They regret that. This is somebody who, whether they know you know the truth of the matter. They like the bad part about whatever this is for me, collective, is the fact that this person. Like somebody out here, and it could be, like I said, something deals with what you do for a living. So somebody here could be spiritually gifted and you use your gifts. Like this is how you were able to establish yourself or get, you know, you just, you started building on what's natural to you. Like, you know what I'm saying? What comes natural to you, what's natural to you. And somewhere there, I don't know if this person was like kind of talking about you behind your back. Looks like it. They were definitely wearing a mask here. But it looks like they're they're dealing with something where they're going or they're they're dealing with something where your friendship would have been very useful in wherever they're at in life. And some of you may be fine seeing this about a friend in this next coming up week, unfortunately. Yeah. And I feel like it's going to be very shocking. What's been held from you is going to be very shocking because of the, the, either the amount of time something has happened. Like something is like, like the amount of times something has happened, I feel like that's going to be where somebody's like, like what? Like it's not even, 
It's shocking that it happened. But it's the amount of times something has happened or this person has betrayed you. Yeah, this would be like somebody like, I don't know what's going on here. We're going to find out in the clarifiers. But there's definitely something here that somebody didn't, doesn't see coming or didn't see because I don't know who someone paired up with. But this would be your person trying to juggle you and talk behind your back. But the person that they're talking about behind your back to is juggling them. Like they had their own agenda. And for some people here, they, it actually was somebody who, you know, works undercover. For some people. Yeah. And, and and all of this is happening. So, okay, like, so, okay, so why are you telling us that? Oh, oh that's old news. Because you're going to see... For, for those of you who you no longer, this friend been not your friend like that, like you wish them well, okay, good riddance, get on with your life because obviously I'm not of no, I'm no, I'm of no importance to you in your schedule. We just don't, you know, it's different if you're communicating. This is what's been going on. It's just been busy, da, 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 da. You know how that is when you like, but you still make time to link up with your friend. I ain't seen you in forever. La, da, 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 da. Like, let me, let's go to lunch. Let's go do something. You know, just make sure you communicating with your friend. Like, within a, you know, blah, 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 blah. Let's get together, go to lunch, dinner, brunch, whatever, to link up. You feel me? Like, if you know, because I feel like true friends really don't have to speak every day. But you speak for the important things, at least. The important things, just checking in, you know, blah, blah, blah. This is someone who fell all the way off. Like, they, it's no acknowledgement. Like, they, it, but it's because of them feeling like something else, another option or another way was more of their norm. Because some of you could, I don't know. It just depends on what you do for a living. I don't know. Maybe you, some of you could talk to dead people. <laughs> hey, anyway. <laughs> um, but yeah, you're just going to see the truth about why something fizzled out or went away. You're going to see the truth behind the matter. You're going to see. And you're probably going to know. I just heard hit dog on holla. So you're probably going to know by wherever something hits it. Wherever the wherever the tower is and however close in proximity you will know. Okay. Um, you're gonna just know. Like, wow, that's awful close. Cause it could be like this would be like somebody who who is their friend. Maybe it's not your friend, but maybe you and this person had a mutual friend. It's gonna be something like that. Cause there is something that is changing. It's a permanent bad ending here. I don't know what this ten of swords is yet, but uh the hermit most times could be a spirit or a ghost. Okay. Um, so it's or somebody undercover. But you take it out, resonates. These, these two are sitting on top of each other. So we're gonna definitely clarify that what that Ten of Swords is because we do have the Death card here. We do have the Tower card here. But I just feel like it's a shocking betrayal. It's a You don't forget why the bus is here because it definitely like it's a bus. Forget why that's here. It's who on the paperwork. That's, that is what could be coming out. Who's Who's been working with who who were you betraying me for what information were you sharing you know it's something like that it'll be like somebody getting information from you to give it to another person and for some reason your friend didn't know that that's the only reason i done done this reading before and i can't remember what it is which one it is but this is somebody playing up underneath somebody just they don't even want to be your friend for real they probably know about your friend know something about your friend that you don't know about your friend and they, because you're their friend, they're going to live vicariously through you to connect with you through their friend. It's something like that. So just be mindful of that. I don't know where it falls in it, but you would get it if it's for you. But like I said, this doesn't have to be friends. This could be cousins. This could be sisters, brothers. This could be people that people are in relationship with. It's not even just what's been going on. It's just who is in it. The identity. 
the identity of who someone is is what's whoever someone is the identity of who who what a smoke coming from or who been behind the scenes doing this reporting this turning this in blah 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 who somebody look at this kindness who somebody who's being a friend who been being a friend to is going to be the shocker Somebody who somebody's been consoling them for years or something like that. It's it's who's been dragging your name. It's who's been, it's who somebody, okay, your person could cheat, but it's who they cheating with. It's who the side person is. It's who, it's, it's who the, it's who be the daddy. It's who be who somebody's sleeping with. It's who be the, the. The informant is who is who is who who I don't know something got something to do with an owl <laughs> I don't know who oh I gotta I gotta read on that I believe but anyway um so anyway week ahead there it does appear to be a tower yeah some kind of revelation some kind of revealing. Um, something in regards to identity is either someone not knowing the identity of someone and got themselves in a heap of trouble. For some people, that's what it is. Something's changing here, though. And I'm getting like an even fair swap off. Yeah, I'm getting eye for an eye. I'm getting fair trade here. Tables turning, shoe on the other foot, okay? So breathe. It says the calmer you are, the more time slows down and the easier it is to get everything done. So relax, okay, for whoever that's for. Kindness. What if being kind to yourself really could change everything, okay? It says I know, regret says I know that I cannot change the past. Friendship. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason, Communicate clearly within the next few months, okay? Uh, sacral chakra, uh, the number six, autumn. The number 21, the number 12, the number three. Um, take it how it resonates. Um, but we're going to leave it here. If you want the full message, we'll see you on Patreon. If not, we'll see you when we post on YouTube again. Um, I... Pray you all have a blessed week, YouTube. Um, yeah, please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye.